Hey YouTube, it's me, it's your iPhone captain. I'm real excited to make this video today. I'm going to show you how to install Siri on your iPhone 4, 3GS, iPod Touch 4G, iPod Touch 3G, iPad 3, iPad 2, iPad 1. More or less what it boils down to is any device running iOS 5, 501, and 511. Okay, so let's get down to the reason you came or clicked on this video to learn how to install Siri on your device. All right, what I did when I was installing it earlier is I took a few screenshots to show you what you need to do. Uh, the first and most important thing you need to do first is... Give me just one second here. You're going to have to install a repo. Okay? And that repo is going to be on the screen. And the repo that you need to install is... Repo.SiriPort.RU Now once that reloads, I'm sorry, once your data loads and it goes through the process of putting it on there, it'll say return to city or something like that. You want to come back to your sources, you want to click SiriPort.RU and you're going to install whichever Siri port for your device that you need to click on. If you're using the iPhone, you'll click on the one up here that says original. If you're using the iPad, you're going to click the one at the bottom. If you're using the 4S, why you'd be putting a Siri port on the 4S, I don't know. But anyway, there it is. Um, I used Siri port for the iPad, and this works for iPad 1, 2, and 3 generation. So we do have Siri on there now. Once you install this... You want to reboot your device. That means you power it off and turn it back on when everything comes back up. Uh, you're going to have to invoke Siri and say hi or hello to Siri maybe a couple times. It may be a couple hundred times. I shouldn't say a couple hundred. Hope it won't be that much. Anywhere from five minutes to 30 minutes it might take this to activate. Uh, I just installed mine, so mine probably isn't activated yet, but we will go ahead and try it again. Siri. I'm really sorry about this, but I can't take any requests right now. Please try again in a little while. But you can hear her speaking, and we do know that that is connected to a Siri connection, or we wouldn't even have that much. So, hello. And you see that time there, it worked. And she's working right now. Okay, I, ins I, ins I only installed this about three or four minutes. And I've only asked or said hello to her maybe six or seven times. I was hoping it would start working during the video. Let's try it one more time. Hello? Sorry, I'm not able to help you right now. Please try me again in a little while. What's... Something's amiss. Can you check that? What's the weather? I'm really Hello? There's something. Hello? Sorry, I'm not getting And as you can see, she's now. still not working, try but try back in maybe about 30 minutes or so after you give it some time to. They, they have to record these on the. Um, wherever they got this port at. Or. Um, it takes a little time, guys, to get this thing up and running. Okay, and one more thing before we go. Um, once you install that, you're going to be seeing a couple screens that look like this. And when you, you need to click Start Using iPad, 
and then you will need to open up your settings and you will see the Siri selection there tap on that and when you open that you need to make sure that that's on before I rebooted my device I would actually turn this off and turn it back on to make sure that your device actually installed Siri properly so hopefully guys this will help you out. If you have any problems or questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. Don't forget, guys, come over to iPhoneCaptain.com.